What's up guys, Matt here, and in this video, I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing this Kepi Bench 1000 Pro. It's a super durable workout bench, and I'm essentially going to be making this video as a video that I wish I saw before getting this bench. So full disclosure, I did get the bench in order to do this video, but it won't be affecting anything I say. I also just genuinely love working out, and this has been a great addition to my home setup. That being said, let's hop back in time before I unpackaged it and walk through it all. All right, guys, if you're anything like me, you like laying out everything all organized so you can see everything you need. So let's get to the manual and start assembling this. All right, it is completely set up now. The manual was only 11 pages for English, so it actually went really quick and was summed up in just like six steps. So that was super straightforward. It did take me about 25 minutes and all the tools necessary are included. To kind of just show you around quick on how this all works. So if you want to raise this angle, you just simply just pull out the pin and then lift and then lock it back into place. So once again, pull the pin, drop it down, and then lock it. You can screw it in, that threading. And what's happening here is that pin is going all the way even deeper through. So now you can't even pull the pin out and it's locked in position. And we have the same situation here. So you could just pull the pin <laughs> to drop it down if you want. And then to lock it in position, you just raise it until it locks into the next one and then you can twist that to lock that threading in. It does also have some really nice wheels. So transporting this is super simple. You can grab this handle and just roll it around. I was actually really, really impressed with that. Some of the features this bench has is an absolutely flat decline angle, which is how I have it set currently, which is great, especially for bench press. It is super stable during exercise and I was surprised when I first sat on it how sturdy it was and how heavy duty. You can see all the bolts and screws used are crazy thick and extra durable. This thing has a weight capacity of 1200 pounds. <laughs> so uh, it is extremely sturdy. There's some soft high grade leather padding here. And here's kind of a inside look at the stitching and what to expect there. There are 12 different gears and they have the amount of degrees labeled on it. So it does go all the way up to 90 degrees being straight up. And then there's three different gears for the seat rest starting at zero, 10 and 20 degrees. This locking system is a high strength alloy locking system just to add that extra strength and security where it's most needed. The leg support is removable here. If you loosen this pin and undo that threading and then you can use this included cap in place of the leg support instead if you did want to. The handle on the leg support makes it super easy to move. That's exactly what it's for, for lifting this up and rolling it on the wheels. And last but not least, let's actually put this thing to use. Here are some examples of me actually working out on the bench. It's obviously super sturdy, great for bench press with the completely flat motion or adding an angle for the backrest if you want. And it is awesome for abs, getting a negative 20 degree angle. So I hope this video showed you exactly what to expect with this crazy durable and strong workout bench. I will catch you guys on the next one. See ya.